Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy, I should bring you guys a quick video. Guys, this video is for you guys and you guys only, so that way you guys can know what is coming in the next few weeks with the item stop shop and stuff like that, because I know a lot of people like to know whether the next items coming out are actually purchasable or if they're just not worth it. So I want to bring you guys this video so that way you guys can actually save up. And also, I want to give you an opportunity if you guys can kill a thousand likes on this video, I will be doing a giveaway on any one of these skins. You guys gotta let me know down in the comment section below which one of those skins are your favorite skins. But with that being said, let's get into the video. It's going to be a shorter video, but this video is just for you guys to have knowledge of what is coming in the near future. So upcoming cosmetics found in patch version 5.1.0 files, data mining of the uh, the file patch has released is releasing tomorrow already downloadable on the new chinese version of the game reveals a number of upcoming cosmetics we should see in battle royale over the next upcoming weeks so basically these are the pickaxes we got the clutch axe and harpoon axe i don't care too much about these two pickaxes maybe this i don't know honestly this one's kind of cool because it's a harpoon but it's not like you're going to be able to actually shoot it or anything like that so i don't know too much maybe if i had the shark skin i would like it a lot more this one is cool just because of the gold chain i honestly like the gold chain and this eight ball that is at the bottom of it I like those two features added to that. I kind of like that pickaxe a little bit more than the harpoon one. But again, that's just my personal opinion. So now we have the skins, which I actually like that they're doing this with the skins. As you guys can see, these are two brand new skins, but they're also brand new faces. We're not seeing the same old faces. Like as you guys can see over here, we got this girl and this girl's face. The ex same exact person, just the hair is different. The facial structure is the exact same. Everything about it is the exact same. So they've been doing the same faces as the default skins for a while. They've just been changing the hair colors and basically the cosmetics on that person but now we're starting to see actually new people added to the game now i think i think the reason we're getting like this baywatch looking guy the the rescue guard or whatever you guys want to call him and uh i guess these new skin and new faces is honestly because the portal is open so we're starting to see real world people added to the game like this this guy i guess and then this guy so they look like people that we would see in today's everyday world so basically i think they're probably taking skins from i don't know magazines or something like that and they're just making into a game i have no clue how they're doing it but that's my honest opinion i don't care for these two skins i don't care for these two skins uh we have the shade which is epic and the reef ranger and then we have these two which the rec raider and the arch archetype archetype i don't know how to explain it this is definitely not from the real world but these other ones are so this is probably my favorite one and to be honest if we're if we're being completely honest it's the only skin that i care about um let me show you guys a bigger image of it let me open this up in a new image as you guys can see this is the only skin that i probably care about just because the other ones are just they're just normal people i mean i don't want to spend money on just normal people skins you know i want something crazy i want to spend money on something different if they added like naruto or dragon ball z skins to the game you already know i'm buying it so fortnite if you're, if you're watching this video make a collab man make take the time to spend some money to collab with dragon ball z or naruto or anything like that make a collab and you guys are going to make millions of dollars i promise you that they will too as well because you got to collab with them but again it, it will work so now we have the 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 uh what are these called the gliders i guess you want to call them this one is the second legendary glider added to the game so the first one is the chinese dragon that we saw i actually have that one this is going to be the second legendary glider you already know i'm gonna buy it just because it's legendary they're rare not everyone has them because they're too big they're too bulky and people don't like them too much because they get in the way and stuff like that so this is gonna be one of the gliders i'll probably end up getting i might get this glider as well just because it matches this guy really well and it looks really cool it looks like something just uh, i really like it i like the glider a lot it looks really cool um but besides that those those are the two gliders coming out and then if we come down we have the birthday cake which if you don't know they're celebrating fortnite's one year anniversary for battle royale and then we have the back blings and stuff like that now these back blings aren't too special these two are kind of cool um i like the shark one but besides that these are just kind of boring things and then we have some emotes coming to the game um but honestly i'm not too happy i'm not too ecstatic about these new skins you guys gotta let me know down in the comment section below what do you think maybe this is just my personal opinion and maybe i'm completely wrong you guys gotta let me know by giving the video a thumbs up and let me letting me know in the comments if they're starting to slack on skins i want to know you guys honest opinions but with that being said thank you guys for all the love all the support and i'll see you guys in the next video peace